we were in a position really to start the preparation and to start the presidency six months earlier, but I believe we are doing everything needed and everything possible to prepare ourselves in a good way, so to take over the presidency as the 1st of uh, January 2018. Maybe it was kind of a populism, but I think it is the most important priority for all of us now is to protect the rights of European citizens living and working in the United Kingdom and vice versa. Our national position is to be balanced, to be as much as possible to, to, me, to mediate and to provide the, the good ground for, uh, for a, if necessary, a tough discussion, but to keep the unity along uh, all those debates which are forthcoming. Uh, indeed, one of the priorities of the Bulgarian presidency are the Western Balkans. And uh, as a part of this priority, we would like and we are planning to have a special uh, summit on the Western Balkans within our presidency, maybe somewhere in May. We are still uh, analyzing the case uh, while focusing on that, that priority. Uh, other priorities for us uh, will be definitely continue all efforts with, with respect to security and migration. And uh, the other important priority is the cohesion policy. As, uh, as it appears in the, from the last discussions and the debates in the parliament as well, we expect the debate on the multi-annual financial framework after 2020 uh, to start within Bulgarian presidency in spring next year. So we are now preparing as well, not only the debate on the future MMF, uh, but to have a very high level summit or event ministerial meeting together with the European Parliament, European Commission, the Council and the Committee of the Regions on the future of the territorial cohesion because uh, we think that we shall combine all the efforts and achieve, uh, let's say, agreements up to now but to, have, uh, to provide more synergy between the cohesion policy, the territorial agenda and the urban agenda agreed within the Act of uh, Amsterdam. It's not a matter of punishment, and uh, I believe Bulgaria sh uh, should be supported in all our efforts being an external border, being in the front line of the refugees flow through Turkey and through, through other borders of Bulgaria. Um, but uh, there is an important part of the Bulgarian position, on the, both on the cohesion policy and the future MMF, uh, we believe, first of all, we need to have the next MMF uh, with a uh, wide range of uh, flexibility in or, uh, with a kind of a reserve fund where we need uh, uh, using uh, the reserve uh, this reserve fund shall be used for to cover any, any kind of unexpected circumstances on one side. On the other side, we are at the position that uh, the cohesion policy instruments and the migration uh, uh, funding needed we shall not oppose them. There should be no competition between those two because we as a cohesion country, we as a, as a less developed region of the EU, strongly believe and support the future of the cohesion policy because otherwise we will deepen the disparities between the regions in the EU. On the other side, we need to provide the necessary funding and the necessary assurance that all, all the measures for migration and for security are well provi are, are provided and, of course, financed out of the EU budget. So there should be complementarity rather than competition between the two policy. But having in mind the Brexit and uh, the less funding expected there, uh, there should be focus on simplification and more efficiency of the, of the funds and the provisions for the funds. First of all, Bulgaria is a country which is fiscally and economically, politically stable. The stability of, of our economy provided uh, excellent ground for economic growth. And these are the, the steps forward which are undertaken by the government. 
Second, we have uh, excellent cooperation and neighborhood policy with our neighbors, both on, with Turkey, with Greece, with Romania, and uh, the countries from the Western Balkans, Serbia and Macedonia. Also, Bulgaria is one of the most Euro-optimistic countries in the EU. And the something uh, else uh, very important for us is our cultural heritage. So we will use the opportunity of not only being the president in the presidency, but uh, 2018 is the year of the European uh, cultural heritage. So we, will, we are proud of our heritage and we would like to share everything we are rich of.